good morning. Today is January 9th. And it's about noon here in Northeast Texas. Sun, well, you know, it's not awesome, but you know, it's good. You can kind of see there's some haze. We're going to be doing a solar panel comparison of the GoLabs 100 watt panel, which I'm not sure is still available. I haven't seen it available in a Bluetti PV120. And we're gonna charge the Bluetti EB3A, see what kind of input we can get on this day for comparison's sake. Um, they're a different shape. They're pretty much the same size. The GoLabs panel feels a lot heavier in my hands. In fact, I had to get on the scale and weigh them both and they both weigh exactly the same, 12 and a half pounds. So I'm gonna open them up and then we're gonna get started. Okay, first of all, the legs on the bloody are adjustable for angle. The go labs are not adjustable at all. The go labs panel is a smooth finish, does not have that new EP whatever finish on it. And the blue Eddie does. They both have similar waterproofedness. Um, the blue Eddie comes with your MC4 cables only. The Go Labs, you can hook up USBs. USB-C, 60 watts, I believe. It comes with a 5521 to 5525 cord and a bunch of adapters. And it comes with some metal stakes that you can uh, stick it down. And the bloody doesn't come with anything else. It doesn't have any other adapters to hook up. It only has the MC4 because it is designed to charge your Blue Eddies. That's all you need. So I'm going to plug them up here and then uh, we're going to see what kind we get, wattage we get. One more thing to note GoLabs has four panels and four legs. And Blue Eddy has four panels and three legs. Alright, so 120 watt panel, 100 watt panel. I got them as close as I can get. And now we're gonna see what we get. Alright, we're on the Go Labs panel. Has LED indicators showing it's getting power. And on the Blue Eddy EB3A, we're getting 65 watts. All right, so now we switch to the Bluetti 120 watt panel. We're getting significantly more power at 113 watts. Uh, yup, that's a significantly better panel. And they are side by side same angle oh don't look into the sun so there you go that's the side by side as best i can do today thank you all right so just as a little bonus footage i'm gonna plug i took my 200 watt energy panels that are on the roof and i disconnected them from the charge controller and we're gonna plug it in and see what 200 watts of, I mean, they're 200 watt panels in parallel. See what that'll do. Same, it's within five minutes of the last video. It's, you know, same angle pretty much.
So about 11 to 12 watts more than the foldable 120 watt panel. And this is two 100 watt panels. So there you go. It's a pretty efficient panel. Thanks.